Hello friends, welcome to RS Home Tutor. We are in the quadratic equations in 5.2, question number 8. The question is given in this way. Two trains leave a railway station at the same time. The first train travels towards west and the second train towards north. The first train travels 5 km per hour faster than the second train. If after 2 hours they are 50 km apart, find the average speed of each train. The question is here we have two trains uh, going in different directions, not opposite. So when it is going different directions, first we will take a diagram and after that we will see. Here I am showing the directions. As you are very familiar that the north and south and east and west. Now we will take a point. The two trains are started at a same point. The first train towards west. So here it is. So I am mocking here. It is going in this way and the second train it is towards it is north so I have taken in this way if I join this I am getting a right angle triangle so this question is based on the Pythagoras theorem simple as simple as that let and he has given that 50 kilometers apart so this is n and w the points n and w we have 50 kilometers apart now the first train and second train having a different speeds when they have different speeds the let us will take it as a speed of first train let the speed of first train what I am taking the speed of first train is x plus 5 and the second train speed is how much second train speed is I am taking it as x so both are in kilometers per hour kilometers per hour he told that the first train is going fastly now we will consider so this is a right angle triangle now the first train is going with the direction of north so how much time it is traveled it traveled two hours this is very very important so both the trains travel two hours as you know that the formula of the um, between the relation between distance and time and speed we have only one thing that s is equal to vt so distance is equal to velocity into time so if I write clearly distance is equal to velocity into time so you know already the time is for two trains it is two hours if I take the first train the first train velocity is x plus 5 
so I am taking it as x plus 5 so x plus 5 into 2 so the faster train is going with this much distance 2 into x plus 5 so this is about the first first train distance of traveling the first train so distance traveling the second train is equal to velocity its velocity is x and it is taken time is 2 hours so this is distance covered by the second train is x into 2 so that is 2x so here we got a right angle triangle and we know each and every side if you apply the Pythagoras theorem what Pythagoras theorem says that base square plus height square is equal to hypotenuse square so what is the base base is 2x plus 10 whole square plus height is how much 2x whole square is equal to hypotenuse square that is nothing but 50 square if you apply the formula a plus b whole square you will get it as 4x square a square plus b square b is how much 10 square 10 square is 100 plus 2 into first term into second term so 2 into first term into second term 2 into 2x into 10 plus this is 4x square is equal to 25 double 100 mm -hmm. so this is the value we are getting here if I go for further simplification so 8x square 4x square and 4x square 8x square and here 2 into 2 4 4 into 10 40x and this is 100 and this is 2500 if 2500 comes inside this becomes minus 2400 why because of we have already 100 here 100 minus 2500 that is 2400 now if you divide this equation by 8 so each number we are divided by 8 so that we will get a yes, simplest equation simplest quadratic equation that is x square plus 5x minus 300 is equal to here also I am dividing both the sides we have to divide it so that is 0 now if you solve this equation we will get the value of x the what is the value of x the speed of second train but he is asking the average speed of a train so we will go further so this is the equation we got earlier x square plus 5x minus 300 I am copying here x square plus 5x minus 300 is equal to 0 if I simplify this if I solve this the product should be minus 300 1 into minus 300 that is minus 300 the sum should be 5 so what are the factors we have many factors but uh, this will fit here so 20 15 is a 20 15 is a 300 20 minus 15 that is 5 so the sum is my 5 and the product is 300 so this these are the factors for minus 300 now if you substitute in this x square plus 20x minus 15x minus 300 is equal to 0 so if I take x common in the both the terms 
x plus 20 minus 15 into x plus 20 is equal to 0. So x plus 20, x plus 20 if I take out common. So this is left out to me x minus 15 is equal to 0. So x plus 20 is equal to 0 or x minus 15 is equal to 0. So x is equal to minus 20 or 15. So but the speed cannot be negative. So we are discarding this. So we got the value of x. So what is the value of x? What is the value of x? The value of x is speed of second train. Uh, so speed of So speed of so speed of second train is equal to fifteen. In the given sum, he already told that the first train is five kilometers very fast. So fifteen plus five, so that is equal to twenty kilometers per hour. And this is also kilometers per 